Like the title says, the car is totaled. I don't even, you know, I, I can't even get to doing like a full intro right now. Hope you guys are doing fine. I'm just going to talk to you guys in real. That car meant a lot to me. You know, a lot of my original OG subscribers, you know, um, from way back in the day, since my college days, some of you guys know that car was my dad's favorite car. And I lost my dad uh, about two years ago. And if you go back on my videos, you can definitely see, you'll probably know where I actually lost my dad. Uh, Cause you can see my de demeanor uh, just go from, you know, happy. And then the next video is just kind of off a little bit. It was my update video uh, to my headlights. Losing my dad was definitely hard guys. Uh, but I never try to, you know, show that to you, I guess, because it's personal, you know, it's very personal. It can, uh, uh, you know, I didn't know how to handle it myself uh, at that time. So it, it, it was just really hard. And and so I had to seriously become like a man of my family uh, and just take care of everyone. A lot of people do say like, where's your red Honda Accord? Where's your Tacoma? You know, why, why didn't you ever show this? It's it, guys, they're with my family members because I'm the main provider now. And you definitely do anything for your family, guys. So family always comes first. I'm not trying to be cliche or anything, but in my personal life, just like how Dom, you know, from Fast and the Furious said, he doesn't have any friends. He only has family, and that's true with me. If you become my really close friend, you're my family. If you require anything, and if I'm always there, I will always be able to provide. And that's kind of like what my dad taught me, honestly. Uh, you know, so that car, the Honda Accord, meant a lot to me. And me waking up yesterday morning, I couldn't even, you know, honestly make the video yesterday because I was extremely devastated i was super devastated you know waking up checking my you know status for progressive um and seeing that my car status saying totaled loss total loss it was like losing some it was losing it was almost losing part of my family once again Apparently the mold had got so much into the actual vent, into the AC system, into the, into a lot of the actual AC pretty much, uh, you know, where you turn on your AC, it, it, all this stuff will blow into your face. You know, you don't want that. And sometimes they don't even check your car. Uh, they just say, oh, your car got in a flood. Okay. Total loss. But in my case, they actually did come out and they did check the car to see if it was going to be okay. But unfortunately it's not. And they deemed it a total loss. Here's a quick clip of, you know, my Honda Accord at the dealership with the big total sign on the windshield. Just very sad looking. And I'll play it for you right here. Okay, guys. So here's the actual car right here sitting down with the big total sign. I mean, it's so funny. It looks like a perfect beauty, but yet it's totaled. You know, this car was a big part of my YouTube channel and you guys basically. And it's really sad to see it go. And I got the tail lights back there and stuff. It's just sitting here now. It's going to be towed tomorrow, taken away. The legendary Honda Accord, guys, with the LEDs. This is an eternal beauty that is totaled. But I absolutely love this car, guys. You know, we'll see what happens next. We'll definitely see what happens next. You know, I was pretty uh, devastated, kind of shaking also. And uh, whatever I said right there, I was, you know, just saying it in spur of my mind. Now you can definitely keep the car. However, the insurance company would definitely give me a lot less uh, for keeping the car. And then I would definitely have to put my own money into, you know, repairing the AC system, repairing, removing the carpet. So I'm looking at close to, I don't even know, like to replace the carpets was already $2,000. To replace entire AC vents and stuff, that was gonna be, I don't even wanna know. So it's really not feasible for me to keep uh, the car, the legendary Honda Accord. After talking to everyone, I decided that um, I decided I've got to have to let it go. I do want to thank everyone for their support, honestly. I really like many of your comments that you guys put on my last video. But one awesome comment that I think right when I posted the video, someone commented. He said, hope you get straight with the insurance. Keep your head up, man. Old things bring new. And I really appreciate that comment. I mean, it did. It did make me smile. Trust me, guys. I read every single comment. This one was for Jamal Rose. And comments like this, guys, definitely bring up your morale. Uh, make you feel a lot better. So I definitely appreciate that. But yeah, so, you know, now that the Honda Accord is gone, uh, before even I made this video they've been saying hey if your Honda Accord goes away you should get a used 2015 Honda Accord or some people have been saying hey you should get the new 2018 Honda Accord some people have also saying hey you should get a completely different car like a Mercedes BMW or you know something more luxury some people are saying hey you should get the new Toyota Camry there's many different options I don't know what I should get honestly let me soak it all in let me see
see what's going on uh obviously leave your comments down below of what car i should get uh, i have to say i was definitely bummed out with the last generation of cords where the sport model did not come with a push button start nor did it come with a sunroof i do like that it's in the 2018 model but a lot of people including myself kind of don't like the back of it that much i totally understand if you do you know that's your opinion okay like i totally understand if you do i'm not knocking your opinion you know if you like the 2018 honda accord the back and stuff definitely that's awesome and uh, you know i, I kind of find the styling a little bit awkward i kind of see what they're trying to do but it's kind of just like someone took a honda civic and made it a little bit wider and put it on the back of a honda accord 2018 doesn't look the best to me uh the camry is better i test drove the camry uh before even any of this happened i just wanted to see what the camry is all about uh the new camry and the camera is okay i mean you can still tell it's a camry you know uh it's not bad but i will be paying like a premium solid premium to get like the nice features of the camry so i don't know if i want to do a camry either what in my opinion i'm definitely considering something more luxury uh but not so expensive either you know i want to make sure that you guys know me i want the price low but the quality up here you know so We'll have to see, you know, I want to I want to make sure that I'm getting a good deal of a car in the future, you know, maybe a one year or two year old luxury car with low mileage. I don't know. We'll have to see, you know, there are plenty of cars out there. We'll have to see. Put your comments down below, you know, what car that you guys like, because everyone has a different option, obviously, you know, and if it is the 2018 Honda Accord, if you like that, put it in the comment below. I want to see what you guys have to think about it. Even if you think maybe a Tesla, go ahead, put that in the description below too. I, you know, you guys know me. I love the Tesla. I absolutely love the Tesla. Tesla. the price might be really high i have to say but the tesla is definitely a nice car you know we'll have to see or mercedes bmw genesis audi whatever it is put it in the description below i want to check it out i want to read all your comments and like i said i really appreciate all the nice comments this honda accord her name shadow named after my black cat and i want to see what the future has to hold tomorrow is definitely a new day and every day is different and i want to thank everyone for always supporting my channel and let's see what the next chapter of clean tricks has to offer so with that guys that's been this video hope you guys enjoyed it any links to facebook instagram and all those links to my other lights and stuff are in the description below like always there should be a subscribe button and also a video button popping up right here make sure you click on it for more videos in the future but other than that guys can't just share saying thanks for watching and peace